consistent things from him. He's a guy who has the tools. The staff believes in him. He's just got to minimize the turnovers, minimize the negative plays, and he's got a chance to do some special things. I hope we don't see it on the Idaho side. That's where you see the – they're just not in rhythm right now. They're not gelling right now. Just a special teams play very easily. Could have been one guy calls it out. I got it. You go block. But instead – we almost had disaster. A lot on this kid's shoulders, a sophomore. Yeah, they live and die by Matt Linehan and what his abilities are. And again, we mentioned it at the top. Knowledge of the game, all those things. They'll start this series from the nine-yard line is where they spot it. Three receiver look, single running back, play action, and he'll throw it on first down and complete to Jacob Sannon. And that gives him a little breathing room out to the 14-yard line. Changing up the play. Linehan, Basham coming after him, throws, completes it, and a first down grab hauled in by Desmond Epps. You believe he's the X. Here's play action, pressure coming, and down he goes. Quentin Poling, the middle linebacker, got him. We mentioned him last year to three picks. He comes right up the middle, and that's a busted block by number 22, Elijah Penny. The running back supposed to take the linebacker there, he's got to help his center. And who did we spotlight? We just talked about him. Steve Idaho with three picks a year ago. Now it's third and long. Lenahan flushed out of the pocket, throws on the run, catch made. It's Epps, breaks the tackle and cuffs it up. It's recovered by Ohio. They've got the foot. An excellent play, keeps it alive. He extends the play with his feet here. And right there to Epps, and he just does not see. Who else? Number 32. Quinn Poling. This guy is the X factor for this Ohio defense. He comes in and makes the play. The sack and then the force fumble. Especially first game of the season. Linehan with a couple receivers. Play action. He'll roll and throw. Dumps it to his tight end, Buck Cohen. And a simple little play there. Very effective. Up to the 28. Most at the school since 2009, a year ago. Here they are, third and two. They're going to throw it. Lenahan, and it's incomplete. Epps couldn't hang on. Beforehand, you would think they would run the ball again, but instead they try to throw the flat route here. Lenahan's just a little bit too far for Epps. But, man, you want to establish. Hard line. Two receivers left for Lenahan. Wants to put it in the air. Steps away from pressure. In some trouble, and down he goes at the 25-yard line. Four white shirts were there. You'll see Linehan here. This is basically a coverage sack. No one is open. Thankfully, he doesn't force it, so he just had to hang on to it and held on to it until uh, till a bit too long until everybody got there. Last year, off to a good start this year, getting after Linehan. Quick drop this time. Pass deflected and intercepted. It's into the hands of Jovan Johnson, and he takes it to the house. Touchdown, Bobcats. Guy doesn't catch the ball, as you see Linehan here. He's going to look over. Tipped ball falls right into the hands. And we're off to the races there. Touchdown, six points. Number one, Desmond Epps. We need to see him go deep. There it is, the deep ball. And he's got a man, and he overshoots him. Colin Hyde. Six up on the line of scrimmage. Now they fall back. Now Lenahan in some trouble is going to run. Tripped up, and he'll be knocked down shy of the first down. And that was Quentin Poling that got a piece of the ankle. <laughs> In this game, as you see Quentin Poling here. But watch the edge here. 33 just off the edge. No one. That's a breakdown in protection again. Another breakdown for Idaho. It's about a yard and a half for Idaho. Lenahan, pressure coming. Has a man. It's Penny, and it's a first down. Into Ohio territory. Out of bounds. First down at the Bobcats 45-yard line. Play action. Lenahan fires it, has a man, it's Epps, and that's a first down catch to the Ohio. To be the guy that fills that Josh McCain void, he's on the outside, breaks out, excellent route, nice delivery in terms of timing from Lenahan. About him out there, number one, first down from the 29, Lenahan to the sideline, incomplete, he wanted Sannon, and it, he, Epps in the same spot, slot left, Lenahan, time, now he's in trouble, and down he goes at the 37. It collapsed, and it was Basham hitting him from the backside. Yeah, Basham, number 63 on the offensive line here. He's on the edge, and Basham just beats him inside to get to the quarterback. And Calvin White, one of those guys, I mean, we talked with the staff. He's three-receiver look, Penny to his right. 
three-man rush. He's going to run with it. Lenahan across the 30 and cut down at the 32. Three-yard pickup. That was polling in the opening. Polling number 32. But this is what you like about Lenahan is he can make things happen with his leg when a play breaks down or no one's open. He can get you a few yards, but man, oh, man, does number 30. Day. We're going way back, but uh, they would gamble from their side of the field, and here they go. Fourth and one, and it works. The quarterback keeper, Lenahan. They roll the dice again, and it. You'll watch him here. They've been running with Penny up the middle so much that that entire defense bit in the middle. Allow Linehan to get to the edge. Explosiveness, two-yard pickup, second and eight. Linehan, the low snap, throws to the left sideline. It's caught. It's Emwella and Ru First down and second down is get yards to make that third down and manageable. That's what everyone wants to do. As offense, that's what you're looking to do is get a third down and manageable. Well, extra curriculum. As they send a man in motion. Lenahan play action, rolling right. Still rolling. Now he throws and he has his fullback, Manley, and a first down to the 29. Night, college football action here in Moscow, Idaho. Lenahan with pressure, and that's knocked down at the line of scrimmage. That was Kurt Lane. This Idaho offense off rhythm here. Penny comes up and makes a good block. He gets that big paw up. Casey Sales. And now Linehan on second and 10 over the middle. Penny with a catch out of the backfield. And a first down to the 18. From the 17 now, Idaho with some confidence on offense. Empty backfield. Linehan over the middle. Catch made, nifty move made. And down to the backfield right now. Three receiver look for Linehan. Over the middle, catch made. It's Epps, turns on the Jets. He's across the 40 and has a first down and a flag comes in late. And they go Penny up near the line of scrimmage, passing formation. Lenahan completes it and out of bounds is Epps. Epps is really having a... Lenahan has a spot over the middle and dropping down in the zone there is Epps for the... Five on the play clock, takes a snap with two, play action. Over the middle, catch made inside the 10-yard line. Guess who? Number one, Epps. About number one can about what number one can do to get a shot of Linehan there right over the middle. I'm telling you, he's looking for number one every time. If you're on defense, you're like, come on, we got to stop this guy. Now they'll run it with to the right, Penny in the backfield. Now they'll send him in motion. Linehan sips it and it's incomplete. He wanted Epps near the goal line. Broken up. Broken up by who? From the 24-yard line, empty backfield for Lenahan. Has time over the middle. It's Epps again, and a short gain to the 23-yard line. A heavy or hurry-up offense. Just a little bit. Out of the backfield, it's going to be Penny on the screen pass, and he is shut down by Jovan Johnson. Shep. He'll start this drive from the 19th. Blitz is coming from the corner. Lenahan steps away from it. And has to get rid of the football. They dial up the corner. And Leighton creeping up to the line of scrimmage again from his corner position. Lays back. Lenahan will throw it. There's Epps over the middle. Catch number 10 to the 24. Pickup has been busy. They split him out to the left side in a slot this time. Pressure coming on Lenahan. Throws it. It's caught by Hightower, but it's short of the first down their own territory going for it on fourth and short going for it here in the third quarter and they complete it they've completed all three of their fourth down conversions it's caught by Hightower to three times pressure coming Lenahan to the sideline that was almost picked off the catch made by Hightower Leighton almost hit him up <laughs> six yard pickup there from the 39 now Lenahan there's the deep ball downfield Sanon can't come up with it at the 25 yard line where Linehan just leads the receiver just a tad bit too much. And he was open. Just got to throw that ball up and allow that wide receiver to run underneath it. Third and four now. Linehan over the middle. A penny with a catch and a first down to the 46-yard line. Epps has played well today, but not to the extent that Josh McCain did. Pressure again coming. Linehan to the far sideline and 49. Lenahan has time over the middle and deflected and incomplete. Wanted his the Vandals going deep. Now that's one of those where you would have wanted him to throw the ball over the top to allow the wide receiver to run under it. He had his guy beat.
throw it in a, just a little inside. And seven catches a year ago. Second down and short. Lenahan over the middle. Catch made by Epps. First down to the Bobcats. 30. First down at the 39. Hurry up here for the Vandals. They'll hand it off. Fake the handoff to Penny. Throw to Epps again. And he's out of bounds to the 32-yard line. So explosive. On second and three. Lenahan to the sideline. Watson with the grab. And he has a first down. Pressure coming, Basham, and Linehan runs away from it, and now he takes off inside the 20, has a first down, and he dives to the 14-yard line. Second time during this series, we've seen it. They come with an all-out blitz. Linehan gets up, can make some moves, making plays with his legs. Again, this is really what worries <laughs> one. Linehan. Epps has it inside the five, and he's down to the one. First and goal. No time to waste for Lenahan. Throws on the run. Catch made by Watson, and he's run out of bounds. Three receiver look. Watson split to the bottom of the screen. Lenahan looking that way. It's caught by Penny out of the backfield, and he's out of bounds. Michigan had his ups and downs last year, putting up big numbers again in this one. Now he's firing deep downfield. Watson was the target. And passes are not accurate. As you see here from this play, Watson, he throws it outside shoulder, but it's outside out of bounds. Almost impossible. Three of 12 on third downs. This is third and four. Lenahan to the sideline. That's not going to get it done. It's short of the first down. On fourth down, Watson with the catch to keep the drive going. Side, you see 83 lined up. They'll look that way. Lenahan on the keeper. He's in some trouble. And down he goes at the line of scrimmage. They thought about it, but you got to give him a shot. Just in five receivers. Lenahan to the end zone. Touchdown. Watson with the grab. Him on the outside working on number 37, Devin Bass. He just cuts in. And Bass is uh, just coming into your screen super late. So to the right of Linehan. Linehan, end zone, got it. There's the two-pointer. Same guy. Epps, he'll, he'll have a few catches against the Trojans, you got to think. A nice effort today from his wide receiver position. And there's another catch for number one. And he breaks a tackle. And Epps up to the 36-yard line. It's exciting to see that the Vandals have another wide receiver that they can count on. There's Buck Cowan with the grab, the tight end for victory. As the college football season is underway. Lenahan, Epps with catch number 14. He gets out of bounds and stops the clock. Final play here, barring a penalty from the Kibbe Dome in Moscow. Lenahan. Heaves it towards the end zone. It is intercepted by Nate.